What's up guys, Nick from Stack and Stuff. I'm back to you guys with a brand new YouTube video live from the great city of Milwaukee today. We're on our way right now to the Oak Creek Card Show. It's about 15 minutes from here. Today we're looking for baseball as it's almost the end of January and coming into March. That's when people are gonna be starting to look for their baseball. So hopefully move out of some basketball and football and move into some baseball today. So to build off of my last point of getting into more baseball now, so the big thing about sports cards is always the market's changing and the market's evolving. So once we get into baseball season, the brain of sports card investors is not going to be on football again because football is going to be over. You're going to see football fall when we get right after the Super Bowl and even in the playoffs right now. And then when we get into the baseball season, hopefully the lockout's over soon, we're going to see a rise in baseball and the top guys like Juan Soto, Fernando Tatis, Mike, Mike Trout, Shohei Otani, all the top guys we're going to see a rise over time once, once the announcement that the lockout's over and that spring training's coming around. How's it going, guys? My name's Evan. If anybody wants to join my car group, it's called Bring the Heat. Breaks, waffles, and memorabilia. Just come on and join us. Have fun. It's a good group. We do breaks, razzes, all kinds of stuff. So, Hell yeah. yeah He's always been on man. price, too. Yeah. He's been very on price every time that ball. Yeah. So this is a small group I started about a month ago. I'm trying to bring it up. Yeah. Yeah. It's a dollar dog. Yeah. Took on my, took on my Edwards. Took on my... Thanks, man. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Ebo, checkerboard, AJ Terrell. I feel like that's got to be more than 20. And then we picked up some Banes earlier. Some Desmond Bane. Desmond Bane. I think this guy's balling. Bane, 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 Bane. Bane's the, Bane's the future. You got the Herbie on you? Uh, which one? Did you drink the, the 10? Oh, no, I didn't get that yet. Oh. It's, it's still coming from my uh, Oh, you got it in the break? Break. It was, oh. a, it was my friend's first break. He entered, and he got the Chargers. We were like, oh, shit. On Mosaic, FOTL. I don't know what we could get. Like, the last one we hoped was like a Herbert, like, like squirrel. And we got a Herbert, green squirrel, 10 out of 11. Jersey. You're on that train now, right? The train now? Yeah, yeah, bro, the dude pulled the one-on-one. One-on-one, I'll pitch. I'll shit, I'll shit. The big guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We pulled, we pulled the one-on-one on one pack. And it wasn't even FOTL football. It was just regular music. Yeah, that's a cool He's just got one-on-one one Michael Pittman. He's got one-on-one one Michael Pittman. Ooh! Ooh. The boys be dealing. Where'd you find Uh, it's a pretty high stall now. <laughs> and it's inscribed. And it's just pulled for a one card auto. A job from dealer, this has four power, so I'll take the penman. This has four power. Yeah, dude, his penmanship is the yeah. This dude that. sneezed when he died, dude. He was like, what? What did you do? Man's in kindergarten. My dude is in preschool with that penmanship. I picked this up too. This one, that's fine. This one, I feel like, this one just sold for 40. Oh, it did? Yeah, okay. so, so 40, 105, and I'm probably going to see it. Like 8%, 105 pounds. It's Patrick Kane, you know. When am I going to find another Kane out of it? You never know. Yeah. Especially not like that. So. This, I was at 260 on, that's fine. This is 260 to 40. Alright, so we're 
Because this is how, because I was going to run for this, that's how I got the car. Okay. So you, you were at 125, because you Got a deal done with Brady here. Got a bunch of bulk slabs in, a bunch of bulk raw, and the Raphael Devers Bowman Chrome Auto out of 25. And he is picking up Joe Burrow Silver, Kane Auto, Kane Young Guns, Ekblad Future Watch, and a Shea Rookie Auto, and a lot of cash. Appreciate the deal, Brady. Oh, I'm just like such a non-risk kind of person. Yeah. I'm the complete opposite. It, I, I know. I, 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 play, I play a lot of cards and when the casinos got shut down, I got back into this with, you know, my buddy literally called me like a year and a half ago. He's like, dude, get your old Pokemon cards out. You want to rip? I was like, why? He's like, they're worth a ridiculous amount of money. Like, I sold my base Charizard in light play condition for like auction at like ten thousand or a thousand fifty bucks on eBay back wow. like two Decembers ago. It, like that would probably sell for like two hundred. Yeah, last winter was I sold it at like just the right time. It was yeah, people were just getting all hyped up over <laughs> the boredom and, and did you see um, yesterday or? The, the Logan Paul uh, thing? Logan yeah, yeah, Logan Paul's fake uh, the case. His fake case, yeah. Um, that, was, that? that was pretty yeah, unfortunate. He'll get ripped open, but yeah, uh, hope he gets his money back. But he'll be he already, I mean, he already got the money wired back to him. So oh, he did? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But it's more of the guys that, like, the first buyers had a, like, there was a pretty good idea yeah. that they were fake. Yeah. Because I was telling him last night, the guy that sold them the first time in Canada, he talked to like four or five different news stations and gave like three different stories to different people. Yeah. So that should have been the first red flag on how he acquired it. Yeah. But no, no, nobody was worrying about that. Like, and then finally, they, they said it was Yeah, Poker Rep did a, a good video of like recapping like the history of the box and yeah. like the owner saying like, oh, they got it here, then they got it there, and then they acquired it through this. And, uh, so it seemed super sketch. Yeah. It was definitely super sketch. Yeah. So I was just happy that someone at least invested. Yeah. So it's... Yeah. I don't know. I know, I know. I know you guys need to make a little bit of money on this, yeah. so... Um, Too many super recent comps of like the silvers okay. for NBA, but I don't know. 350 ish? Okay. Is it way too high? Or? Yeah, I'd be, okay. I'd be. I just thought that I wasn't sure on like this kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah. No, I mean, I mean like all this base stuff, I mean, a dollar to a piece. Okay. I mean, like a, something like this, like one of the, one of those inserts. 
Like, I don't know if those are closer to 10. I haven't counted any Mosaic okay. football recently, but um, no, let me know. Let me know okay. where you're at. More than willing to work with you. Um, so I'll probably pass on the Herberts then. Okay. Mike, I mean, I can take this out of there. I, can, I would do all those at like five bucks a piece. I'll take, listen, if I get five after a year, it's still five million dollars. Okay, I can, I can think of that. Okay. Then I get to meet the Sean Watson. Maybe. Maybe. Still, who are Jensen? Yeah, yeah those non big, like, colored yeah. ones. I mean, Wiseman. Um, I, I would assume their color is about five bucks a piece, roughly. Okay. Like the haze, silver. What about just like this base? Stuff? That base stuff. Again, I would, I would guess in the five dollar range. Okay. Um, yeah. I just, I don't think. I'm probably just gonna pass on it, honestly, because I thought that these were gonna be like the dollar to two dollar cards. Okay. Right here. Well, what'd you, I mean, shoot me an offer on what you got out here. <laughs> I know Max has been going up, yeah. Albert. Been somewhat steady. That's the bad part. He needs to show something. He's not. He's not. He's not. He's not. Be on like one you be on the lock. Two fifty? Yeah. Um about one seventy five, call a deal. So we didn't waste a bunch of time. Yeah. Um, could you come down to one sixty? Alright, done. Yeah, that's fine. Appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. Seven thousand. Yeah, it's ten out of ten. Okay. That's sweet. No, 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 this one, this one. The uh, Steve Nash. Yeah. Just wanna hear a funny story about that car? Last I'd year, love to. Last year when the Bucks were down on two, I bet this guy 15 grand in the car against that guy. The guy, some guy in Vegas, uh, ACG anything, a uh, site that has like 40,000 people. And he took the bet and uh, he, uh, yeah, he lost obviously. He mailed me my cards. <laughs> yeah, pretty cool. Jeez, that's insane. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a really good time at the Oak Creek show today. I hope to be back again next month. Everybody that made deals with me, I really appreciate it. All the trades, all the buys, all the sells. Picked up a lot of bulk stuff that just moves well for me on eBay and at my showcase. And then a little bit more stuff, like the higher end stuff, like you saw the, the Deavers that I'm just gonna hold on till baseball season. If someone makes me an offer on it, cool. But if not, whatever. I'm, I'm cool with sitting on baseball in, in the next two months. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you can, please leave a like, subscribe, let us know what car show you want to see us go to next. I'll see you guys next time.